Every bride's biggest fear is having her venue canceled before the wedding day. In Omaha, many couples are living this nightmare. Noah's Event Center near 169th and Pacific announced it will be closing its Omaha location, leaving engaged couples stranded without a venue and wondering if they'll get their money back. Reporter Phil Bergman has the story. Seven, come here. Come here, baby. Kendra Jensen is in the midst of her own fairy tale. This past 4th of July, Jensen's boyfriend proposed to her on his boat in Minnesota. It truly felt like time stopped is the only way I can explain it. It was uh, probably the best moment I've ever had in my life so far. Now nine months before the wedding. Yes, I'm redoing every single thing. <laughs> On Tuesday evening, Jensen and her fiance got an email from their venue, Noah's Event Center, that it was shutting down and that they need a new venue. Honestly, my heart sank like right away. As soon as I got the email, it's just like, oh, this cannot be happening. That place and what's going on with it is just an absolute and literal nightmare. And Stephen Finkel is the owner of 402 Event Services in Omaha. He posted a message on wedding Facebook groups letting couples know Noah's is shutting down. Like we had so many people that messaged me after I made that post that had no idea. And that was after the email was supposed to be sent out to all of their Omaha clients. They had no idea. Jensen and her fiance have already put down $3,000 of the $5,200 fee for the venue, money that she's not sure she'll ever see again. It's hard to book another venue without that money. So we're kind of looking at cutting back our guest lists or finding cheaper venues. Noah sent an email to couples saying that they'll be reimbursed, but according to Finkel, couples in other cities where the event space closed didn't get refunds. They can send that an email saying they're going to give refunds, but does that mean they are? I have no idea. I can't say yes. I can't say no. Come here. Jensen and her fiance are back on the venue hunt. They said vendors across the city have been sympathetic to their situation. And at the end of the day, the venue doesn't make the marriage. The most important thing is that you marry who you want to marry, and the place is just a place, and you'll hopefully find something else. Reporting in Omaha, Phil Bergman, 3 News Now. And Jensen said her family has reached out to Noah's, but has not heard anything definitive from them regarding reimbursements. 3 News Now left multiple calls and voicemails with Noah's. They never returned our calls.